Hey folks, it's Mega Man. I'm back with a different kind of video today. Today we're going to do a roster review. Um, so basically, this is who I'm working on right now as far as development goes. I've got Bertolf to level up. Ursaina is almost maxed. Master Lepus is next. I'm going to do a second Guardian Kong. And I have Onatel. Um, the reason why... Let's move that down. Okay. The reason why I don't have any... Uh, nature heroes is because... I only have four tonics. So I only do... Heroes up into the point of that I have materials for them. So I have 12 scopes, uh, 24 tabards, 8 darts, 8 rings, um, and I can do 4 more heroes besides, you know, outside of, of, of for 5 stars. So. That's the basic roster there for development. Um, you know, this is my farming team. No, defense. Whoops. Oh, no wonder why it's getting hammered. I'm trying the Christmas defense. And it's just getting hammered. I gotta rework it. Um, this is my farming team. Just basic AoE. With a sniper and one healer and an overhealer. Um, this is my Titan team for today for Reds. Uh, we have a Green Titan in IR. Uh, blah, blah, blah. This is my Yellow Tanks. Uh, Ursaina is gonna get is gonna get put in where. Where Sartana is right now, and it's just gonna fuel my my uh, my yellow tank uh, offense team even better because Ursaina is gonna get not only is she gonna get maxed, but I'm going to take emblems off of Uraeus here and put them on her. So Uraeus is is maxed, fully emblemed. Um, I don't have enough to limit break him, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna bother with that. Nope, don't want to worry about that. Ah, what else is there? Oh, back to the teams. All right. So, like I said, uh, I'm gonna get some really strong, uh, powers to go along with uh ursena so ursena will be an upgrade over sartana this is my type blue tank team for blue tanks i just run a green mono works pretty well most of the time as you can see i'm a fan of using mother north and heimdall as my healers you'll notice that throughout the whole thing here this is a pretty good team for red tanks I don't find many red tanks lately. Um, green tanks I find a lot of. And purple tanks. So dark tanks. I don't find a lot of those too. Especially Al Freak. Um, but basically, my roster consists of 47 or 48 maxed 5 stars. I think Ursaina is going to be number 48 once she's maxed. Um, so that'll be pretty cool. But basically, as you can just see here, I've got a variety of five stars, uh, some four stars. Um, Falcon is maxed and limit broken. I haven't leveled him up to level 75 yet. I've just been lazy and not wanting to invest in him to 75 just yet. 
Um, just too busy working on my fives. You know. Uh, but as you can see, I've got your standard Freya, Ureas, Mitsuko, Kunshin, Sarnia, Justice, Thorn with costume. Um, I wouldn't have touched Thorn if I didn't pull his costume from HA10. You know, so there's that, and he works pretty pretty damn well. You know, um, yeah. So as you can see, it's just it just goes on and on. I have a pretty good war roster. Um, I did score 160 in this past war. It's been my lowest in a while. Kind of disappointed in that, but that's okay. You know. Um, as you can see, I have two golem bursties that are limit broken with emblems. Um, those guys come in handy for war and events. Uh, this is one of my favorites. It's Anastasia. I don't have a fiend maker other than her, so I don't have Elizabeth or Hannah. Um, so she's my she's my go to fiend maker. You know. So let's see here. Okay, get that. Click that out. Um, Anton is new as a four star. I haven't had a chance to use him yet, but I'm going to an events when I eventually do events again. Um, he's going to be pretty exciting, especially for Magic Tower. Um, his ability to revive. Oh, that's one thing I do want to gloat about. The fact that I have two maxed Mother Norths. This is my first, my second one. And this is my first. I don't have their costume. But who knows? HA10 could give me her costume. I know. Um, so, there's that. If I got her costume, that'd be pretty sweet. I have Ursena and her costume. I forgot to mention that. I know this is all over the place, but this is the first time I've done a roster review. Other than just sitting there and posting my roster in Discord or Line. Um, so bear with me a bit. But yeah, I'm really excited about leveling her. She's going to be a druid. And she'll deal more than 50% health remaining. Okay. Yeah, this, this Ursaina costume is going to be sick. So, and I've just got standard four stars, some season three four stars, some season two four stars, you know, just, and some event four stars. Um, why do I not have two, both Grimm's maxed at the same time? Oh, it must be because one has the costume. Oh, well, yeah, I'm I maxed I'm maxing his costume, but I haven't done anything again. I'm just lazy with with doing these costumes and doing. So I was wondering why both Grims weren't showing up next to each other. I used to use Grim quite a bit when I was starting out. Ah. <sighs> Looking forward to trying him out in uh, in either Rush Wars, or not Rush Wars, uh, Rush Tournaments, or Bloody Battle. I'm thinking of putting him on my Bloody Battle Tournament team. Uh, let's take a look at that team. Alright, Tournaments. Edit team. Da -da 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 -da. I can put Oberon on the on the corner. 
Um, Balthazar also has, 20, has 10 emblems. I've just been going to town on emblems on three stars lately because they're cheap and easy. Um, speaking of which, I have 137 emblems for Wizard. So we're going to go ahead... Retrieval does damage, if I remember right. Deals 250% damage to all targets. All enemies get minus 54% attack. Get 56% defense. Minus 56% defense. Get minus 40%, 44% mana generation. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to max him. Um, as you can see, he's got a level 15 troop, so it's a max troop. Um, I'm just going to go attack. Sword and shield. Until I just run out of emblems. Let's see here. Health. Sword. Okay, that put him up at 12, 12 nodes, so that's pretty damn cool, I you know, um, this is going to be a fun tournament to see how this defense rocks, because Sudri has a level 15 troop under him as well, Ishtok doesn't. Um, as you can see, I did two level 15 troops for Oberon and Trevil. And the only level 15 troop I don't have is for Ishtok. But that's okay, he's a beast. He's going to put you on fire and do damage to up to three. You know, with his costume. So, I wonder if I can actually do anything with him. He's a ranger. Yeah, I can I can put some some nodes on him. Let's see here, node, node. I'm just going sword and shield, and uh, yep, put some put some emblems on him. Can I do anything with Charver? Yes. Oh, I've got two hundred fifty seven druid emblems. Ooh, this is exciting. All right, Jarver, I want attack, sword and shield, sword and shield, druid, druid, attack, sword and shield. Um, yep. Whoops. Oh, well. I'm going too fast, but that's okay. All right. Oh, yeah, this defense is just going to kick ass. And if it doesn't, I'm just going to, I'm just going to cry. I know. Um... But otherwise, so that's the bloody battle. Um, but yeah, no, I've just got, I've got a pretty, pretty robust roster of threes, fours, and fives. Um, so I'm pretty excited about all of this. Anyway, this is just, oh, whoops, an overview. Um... You know. So anyway, this is Mega signing off. Have a great day and thanks for watching.